everybody! How you doing? You won't believe it, but I've actually been standing here with this letter in my hand for ages and ages and ages. I promised you guys, uh, well actually I promised myself that I would save opening it until you were here again. Um, because, well, you know, sharing is caring and I know you are all so curious where the letter came from when I opened it up, um, well actually when I picked it up at the travel agent, uh, on... Monday, I think it was, or the other day. All I know is I'm a little bit scared to open it because the last time I opened the letter, it was a letter from my mom, and she said that she uh, wanted to meet me, so I went to meet her, and it turned out that it was somebody trying to explode me. That's right, somebody tried to blow me up. Not cool. So this time, I'm a little bit more suspicious, and I'm thinking that perhaps... Ugh. Uh, perhaps I should maybe kind of sort of possibly potentially talk to what's in that building It looks like they're eating something really delicious Is this still part of YouTube HQ because if not I want to be inside Eating all the delicious food skis. What's in there? Oh a kitchen. It must be a restaurant guys. How do we get inside? Um, I could break a window, but I don't want to be a vagabond So I'll just go this way and help myself indoors Where is the door? to this amazing place it seems like it's um oh i know what it is it's the bullying school never mind um okay so anyway um i was thinking of opening this letter but i'm scared so what do you guys think should i open it or should i save it or should i open it or should i save it the travel agent did say that a guy dropped it off, which is quite interesting, really. Um, because, uh, I don't know, like, I mean, it, it can't be Stevie Jackson, because Poppy and I have been trying to reach him, and he hasn't been in touch. But I suppose, oh, wow, look at this. It's like Chinatown, and so pretty. Oh, wow, um, I love it. Although, it could mean that there's a big explosion about to happen, so maybe I will just walk on by really fast. See, there's a running theme, explosions, maybe it's a sign. Anyway, Baby Max and I talk regularly, so it's not like he would decide to just surprise me with a letter, right? From a travel agent? I mean, who does that? Although, um, I don't know. It could be, it could be interesting. Alright, uh, what I'm gonna do is, I'm gonna go and find a quiet spot in the park and open it up and see what it says. And you are more than welcome to come with me because, as I said, we're all in this together. Come on, let's make tracks and move! Or let's make like a, let's make like a banana and split! <laughs> Get it? Split? Oh, never mind. <laughs> this is a nice little spot. It's a little secluded. There's not too many people around, so they won't hear me if I'm freaking out about anything. Um, Alright, park myself on the bench. And time to open up this mystery letter. Okay, give me a moment. Oh! Oh my! Uh, guys, this is... This looks kind of weird. It's written in a language that I don't understand. Um... Weird! It's all like squiggles and dots. And like weird shapes and stuff. Um... I'm not sure if it's meant for me. Um... Alright. And then I was thinking that it would be a love letter of sorts. <gasps> oh my gosh, it's Sharon! Oh, I'm such a big fan! Did you send me this letter? Did you send me this letter? You're so cute. Oh my gosh, I'm gonna go away before I make myself look like a fool. Um, but genuinely, lads and girls, um, what should I do? I think I might go to Superhero HQ. Although, if I Google here, um, what this alphabet means, maybe I can find something out. You know, let me give it a try. It's worth it. All right. It looks like it's it's written in a secret font called Wingdings. So if I input all this information into a computer, I'll be able to make out what it says. Sweet. Okay, let me type it in real fast. It might take a while, but because it's a long letter, but I'll try my best. Ah, <sighs> here we go. Okay, I have it all translated on the, on the screen in front of me, and this is, uh, this is a little bit crazy. Uh, it reads, Dear Baby Angel, uh, I am somebody very close to you, who has been meaning to talk to you for a very long time. I have been thinking about you all of my life, and I can't go on another minute not knowing how my little angel is. Please, 
Use these plane tickets and come and visit me. It is important that we make... Make contact. It's been too long. All my love. Kiss, kiss, kiss. What? Oh, all my love. That can't be it. That can't be a mystery letter with some tickets to Japan. Or wherever the tickets are for. I, 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 I don't know. It just... A mystery person expects me to, to go and visit them? Say, what? I mean, who is this? You know, the last time I had a relative touch base saying they wanted to take care of me and look after me, I almost ended up married to my uncle! No, seriously, it, it's true. Look. Diddly, 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 die, gonna get all of their money. Ha, 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 ha. No, wait, I'm not gonna get their money. Because killing their auntie hasn't worked. What am I going to do? They're not 18 yet, so I can't get any of their money, and I can't kill them. Hmm. What can I do? If only I was married to one of them. Could I marry Ropo? No. Hmm. I could marry Baby Angel. But how would I get her to agree to marry me? I know. I could set up a pretend play. Yes. They'll think it's fake. They'll think it's a fake marriage. I'll tell them hmm, that I'll let them go forever if they do this pretend play with me, but it will really be real. And once I am married to Baby Angel, all their money will be mine. Ha ha ha, riddly dee, riddly da, I'm gonna get all of their money. Ha <laughs> ha. I wasn't making it up! It actually happened! And then that guy had the nerve! He had the nerve, Mr. Olaf, to take me to this so-called play in, a, in an actual church! In front, in the home of, of God, or uh, in front of a priest, and actually tried to marry me! So you can see why I would be a little suspicious of this uh, so-called letter with an invitation to a random country to see a randomer. For all I know, Olaf is alive and he's trying to marry me once again. I feel like I am not safe, and I'm not safe at all, and I need to do something about it. Why is my life always full of so much drama? Why can't I just be allowed to enjoy myself, be a young girl, and have fun, huh? Yikes. Anyway, I should probably get home. Poppy is there, and she, um, she should get some medicine. Although, I would rather stay here and play with this chicken! Or a duck, whatever it is! Quack! Quack, 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 quack! <laughs> Woo! Oh, sorry! <gasps> I'm sorry! I'm sorry! Oh, ow! I hurt myself! <laughs> oh, duck chasing is my favorite! Come here! Come here, little ducky walk! Oh, there's another one! Hello! Hello, ducky, 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 ducky! Quack, quack, quack! Quack, 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 quack! Well, rip! <laughs> okay, I have to get home. I'm getting distracted. I'm getting distracted! a long journey to come home. <laughs> I feel like I've been actually walking for hours. I've decided that I need to do less flying, more walking, because it's better exercise. Oh, look at that. The door just stays open these days, it seems. I hope Poppy hasn't been up to more trouble. Last time that happened, I came home, and she was missing. Um, anyway. Um, hello, chef. Actually, she was missing. Where? She's still missing. Chef! Chef! Hey, sh Chef! Ha has Poppy come home since the last time? Uh, b like, remember she had a really, she had a really bad cut? And she bled everywhere? And she went, she went and, uh, like, checked herself into uh, the local, um, GP who, who took care of her wounds? But I haven't seen her all day, I just realized. Is she, uh, oh, oh. Poppy! Uh, pop! Pop, pop! Are you around? Good. Okay, goody, I can hear her. She's probably just, uh, sounds fun. like she's chilling by the roller coaster. No problem. With that in mind, I'm gonna say goodbye, guys. It's been a crazy day for me. 
and I need to go and um, have a little think about what's going on. And maybe find Ropo and talk to him about that letter. But uh, not before I have some fun on the roller coaster with little puppy. <laughs> Bye, guys. Mwah, mwah, mwah.